What's up, Salmon Squad? I am the game Salmon, and welcome to Slinny Tubbies 3 The Apocalypse DLC. So, this obviously is a demo of the upcoming addition to the Slindy Tubbies 3 game that we got last year, and I did not see this coming, and it looks like it will pick up right where Slindy Tubbies 3 left off, looking at all these newborns creepily walking by. Ugh. Wait! If you are excited for some Slindy Tubbies action, please be sure to hit the like button and leave a comment down below. Those are two really easy things that you can do to help out the channel. Oh, and please be sure to subscribe for more spooky stuff. In we go! Play demo chapter! What do we got? Game? <laughs> Look, Ma! I'm all YouTube! Zeoworks presents. Alright, here we are. Christ, it's so dark. My flashlight isn't helping at all. I'm gonna light up a flare. Ah, that's a lot better. I'll go down first. This must be in the middle of the war between... The army and the and the newborns. The coast is clear. You can come down now. Part two. So so this is all part two. All right, your turn now. W. That did say W, right? Three months later. Oh, so a war's been going on for three full months. You go get the machine. I'll check for any newborns coming. This is it. So, what now? We go in there and destroy the damn thing before it does any more damage. Oh, I didn't mean to press and skip something. Yeah, sounds like a good plan. I may have skipped one line, but I think that's okay. Which, by the way, we talked about for three months. I was talking about how we're doing it. We can't just jump the fence to get through. It's too tall. Oh, yeah. I knew that. Well, there were two hallways on the entrance. Go check if one of them leads to the machine. It is this a thing that's creating the newborns? Wait, what? Couldn't you just check where you came in? Will you just go check and stop complaining? I'm pretty sick of having to fight newborns. That's fair. If you've been fighting zombies for three months, I'd get pretty tired too. The last thing I need right now is an idiot complaining and delaying things. Anne, are you hearing this? I... Uh, oh, remember to talk to every character. So I'll talk to you. Uh... Are you gonna do anything? You're not really helping by just standing, staring at the machine. You can do something. Are you ever going to do anything at all? You're just going to stand there. You know what really isn't helping either? Maggot! You, wasting my time instead of finding a way to the machine. I'm wasting your time. You're wasting my time! All of our time! So maybe it would be a lot more helpful that you stopped complaining and did that instead. Jeez. Come on, Sergeant. I know we're in a war. Thought. What is thought? God, he really is obnoxious as hell. I thought he was a cool guy when I first met him, but... Dang. I wouldn't mind it all if the newborns got him. Wow! Wait, was that him thinking it? Oh, no, I'm saying he's obnoxious. And Sergeant Miles is saying that I should just die to newborns. That's not good. Oh, I remember these controls. Oh, man. I didn't really like the, <laughs> the Slendy Tubby's three controls. Uh, okay, I don't think we can enter that door. I'm gonna go talk to Anne, I guess. Hello, Anne. How are you doing, Anne? You hanging in there? How are you holding up? You know, with the outbreak and stuff. It could be worse, but it could be better. I just find it really hard to believe that there's no one else left on Earth anymore. Oh my god! That's some war! In three months, too! Wow, 
Took off the entire planet. We don't really know that. Maybe we'll run into someone. But what if we don't? What if we're actually the last one standing? That would suck. Then we'll have to do our best to fix this. And save Tubby Kind. Don't worry, Annie. Everything will be just fine as long as we move on. And destroy the machine? Yeah, you're right. Thanks, W. Don't even mention it. Is that my name, W? Is it just W? Is that short for something? Has Miles always been like this? Hey, I'm just wondering. Has Miles always been this way? Kind of just an obnoxious jerk? This way? How? You know. <laughs> a moron? Oh, no, not really. Before the outbreak, he was a nice guy. Honestly, I don't know what we went on. I don't know what went on with him. I try to ask him, but he won't tell. I don't know what you two are talking about, but can you please stop aiming that damn flashlight at me? <laughs> I kind of like Sergeant Miles. Jesus Christ. Is he like this with you too? Now that you mention it, no, he isn't. I doubt it's something personal with you, though. I mean, are we both trying to hit on Annie? I see. Thanks for telling me, no problem. Are we both trying to get some Teletubby booty? Thought. I like her. Teletubby booty! That's what I'm saying! I'm glad she didn't turn into an idiot. Me too. I'm gonna put a ring on that later. I kinda feel like that's what's gonna happen. Sergeant Miles is gonna die and I'm gonna marry Annie. Or maybe I'll make like some romantic sacrifice and save her and I, oh, go on without me, Annie. Oh, please, I should have a weapon. Wait, what the? No, Miles, you son of a, open up! Miles, open the gates! Annie, help me! Oh, what am I gonna do now? That was quick, where the hell did they go? Well, now I'm stuck, now I'm going down this path. I really don't really have a choice. I'm gonna speed up the... <laughs> where the hell am I? I don't know! Jiminy Christmas! Oh, I can't run. Can't really look around either. I guess I'm going straight for a while. Oh! Didn't expect that! What is that? The ghost in Lala's dream? I, I recognize this area. This is Lala's dream. What is this place? It looks so... surreal. And why am I walking so slow? It's like I couldn't move any faster. Why? Have you ever tried to punch hard in your dream? You can't do it. So I think I'm in a dream-like state and that's what's happening. What's that light in the distance? I think it's a Slendy Tubby. Is it coming? Oh, it's coming towards me! It's coming towards me! It's coming towards me! Who, oh, please, someone, help! What the hell? What happened? Are you okay? No, he's after me. Who's after you? Please tell us. Huge black monster, shiny mouth. Please, he's gonna kill me. There's a scary thing though. Miles, what the hell's wrong with you? Don't smack me upside the head. Me, what the hell's wrong with him? He's been nothing but useless so far. He made us think something was going on, but no! He was just being an idiot! Not so funny now though, is it, punk? Miles, stop it! You're being a jerk! Thank you, Anne. Why do you keep defending him? He just keeps making things worse! All he had to do was open a stupid door. And there he is, playing something. I couldn't read that fast. What do you know? Maybe he did see something. You don't know what's going on in his head? 
You said it. It's happening in his head. It's not real. A dumb hallucination won't hurt him. He should stop acting like it will. No, but it can scare the hell out of you. It really can. Jesus Christ, Miles. Are you okay, W? No, I'm not. I just freaked out. No, I'm not at all. It hurts a lot. God, I'm so sorry. I have no idea why he did that. Points for me. Are you able to stand up? Yeah, I think I can. That is a weird post. I just kind of did the splits for a sec. Don't worry, I'll be fine. Yeah, I hope so. What about that other thing, though? Did you really see something? I saw a walking shadow. It's really hard to describe. I was in a dark, empty room. I saw something. It looked like a shadow, but it could walk. It had a life of its own. He had a mouth, but it glowed. You could even see it in the distance. That thing. It was after me. I, I was defenseless. I couldn't run. God, that sounds really creepy. But are you sure that you actually saw it? Was it really there? I'm not making this up, Andy. It, it, it wasn't my imagination. It was really there. I'm not saying you're lying. I, I'm just trying to see the possibilities. Smart girl, Anne. Didn't you just say you had hallucinations back in the satellite station? Maybe it could be that. All I know is uh, it felt so real. I, I was fully awoken, but it was like a dream. I understand. Uh, please tell me if this happens again, all right? Kind of sounds like a night terror. Yeah, sure. Thank you. No problem. Stay safe, W. You know, it kind of sounds like sleep paralysis. If you don't know what sleep paralysis is, look it up. Because I had sleep paralysis for about, like, four years back when I was in college. It's not fun. I saw hallucinations, uh, like, basically waking up as I was sleeping. But anyways, moving on. Uh, if you want to know more, just ask me in the comment section. Uh, what is this key card? Because I saw this earlier. Okay, I guess I can't do anything with that. I was seeing if I could take a look at it. Now, I did see these guys, a toy. Are these YouTubers? What are these? Oh, look, there's a toy in here. I don't know what it is, but it looks dumb as hell. This one kind of looks like Markiplier, kind of. Interesting, there are, there's another toy in here. The more I stare at it, the, the more the word Peepo comes to mind. If you guys know what those are, please let me know in the comment section. I'm, I'm really curious. Now, let me see. Where do we go next? I guess we'll go through this door. Can I open the door? Oh, I can't open the door. It's just lock hmm, locked. Not surprised. I could try lockpicking it, but I don't have the resources to do it. Hmm. What do I do now? I guess I'll go chat with my compadres. Uh, the door is locked. I found a way to the machine. The door's locked, though. Do you have a key? And the door is locked, though. <laughs> Hello? No, I mean, why is it relevant to me? So we can get to the machine? Because I have nothing to lockpick it with? Here, you can use this knife. That's not safe, but whatever. I can't just use this knife. I need two objects to do it. Well, that's all I have, okay? Try looking around to see if you find something. Okay, jerk. And for the love of God, please stop nagging me. I, I have, like, the most sinking feeling that Sergeant Miles is just gonna die. Eventually. Maybe not in this demo, but I'm, I think just maybe later he's just gonna die. He's gonna do something stupid. Hey, Ann. What's up? Uh, I found a knife! Look, I found a knife to lockpick the door with! That's a lie! I didn't find it, I was just given to me. Where'd you get it from? 
from Miles. Uh, I asked Miles. You did? Uh, kind of. Wow, I'm surprised you actually did it. I thought you were going to ask me to do it, and I'm astonished. Uh-oh. Was I supposed to ask Annie? All right, all right, I get it. You don't have to be sarcastic. I still need something else, though. Do you, by chance, have any sort of pick or something? No, sorry. Maybe look around. You might find something useful. All right, time to look around. I'm not sure what I'm looking for. Yeah, good idea. Thanks. All right, I'm gonna gonna go. I'll catch you later. Take you out to dinner sometime. Box. Ooh. Sweet. There's a pick inside this box. I could use this to unlock the door. So I, aha, knife and pick, perfect. So let's use this on the door. Oh God, okay, move up and down, left and right to lock pick. Okay. Am I doing it right? Oh God, Get, come on. Am I doing anything? Is this helping? Did I unlock the door? Oh, I guess I didn't. Okay. Oh, boy. <gasps> I had to left click. I had to left click. Okay. Down the stairs I go. Hey, guys, I did it. You can come follow me. Hopefully I won't get killed. Damn, I feel so tired. Why does the stair feel longer than it should be? I can't run, by the way. Uh oh. Ah! Come on! Oh god, not again! No more stairs! No more tinky winkies, please! No more! No more horrible things happen! Oh, okay, please stop! I think that was Dipsy. Is next gonna be Lala or Poe? Or Okay, please make it stop! Oh, I don't like this! It's kind of creepy. I did it. I'm at the bottom. Hooray. I can't, I still can't run. Am I dream, am I still dreaming? I feel like I'm still on the verge of hallucinations. Hello? Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, is that Miles? An Annie? Or... What? Why am I walking so slow? Run! Oh, look who's here. It was about time. What the hell took you so long? Did you get distracted with a funny looking step? Wh what? Was I asleep? Hey, answer me! What's wrong with you? White, are you all right? Hey, White! White! God, I can't believe he passed out because of nothing. Did he really get that tired from going down a stair? Miles, stop it! I can't believe you would- you keep insulting him when he's like this. He could be dead, you know? Have some respect. Can you check a pulse? He's still breathing, isn't he? Plus, it's not my fault, so stop acting like it is. You're being a jerk, Miles! Ugh, whatever. No, Miles, that's not gonna happen. I'm just trying to see what options we have, all right? What if he doesn't wake up? We'd only be wasting time here waiting for something that won't happen. Don't leave me behind. Also, don't kill me, please. We destroy the machine and leave, avoiding a huge horde of newborns coming our way. Just think about that.
There is nothing to think about. We are staying here, and that's it. Annie, my girl, looking out for her man. Ah, uh, fine. He better hurry coming back to life. I think that's what it said. I'd like to wake up, though. Look, I think he's waking up. Hey, wait, can you hear me? W. What? What happened? You took 10 minutes to get down the stairs, then passed out for another 10. That's what happened. I figured it would be hours later, but either way. Are you alright? Did you have another episode? Clearly. I'm, I'm not sure. Oh god, not this again. God, look at you. You're, you look pale as hell. Well, I am white. Like head to toe. Are you able to stand up? I think so. Okay. All good? Yeah, all good. I'm fine. I'm all good for you, baby. Well, don't look. You don't look so good. What happened? You keep asking me, but I'll tell her. She she's Bay. So fine. I I'll talk. Ever since the massacre happened, I've been having these hallucinations. I don't think they're dreams, and I don't know if they're real either. You don't, I don't know why it happens, but after that that happens, I, I can only guess it's one thing. Post-traumatic stress disorder. PTSD. Yeah, that's correct. At least that's what I thought until now. I still don't... I, I, I still don't scrap that thought, but I've also had hallucinations with things I've never seen in my life. But before I saw a huge shadow monster, it was the first time I ever saw something like that. And judging by what you're saying, when I have these visions, what feels like minutes could really be hours. Which is concerning. When I went down the stairs, the staircase became five times its real size and it kept changing. First, it looked like just that place with the shadow monster, and then it looked like the satellite station. And then it looked like a flesh cave. I felt some sort of increasing earthquake, too. I really don't know what to do anymore. I, I feel like I'm going insane. Man, I, I'm sorry. I, I didn't know it was that bad. It's alright. You don't have to be sorry. It's not your fault. But I'm going insane. And if I don't do anything about it, it's gonna get worse. We'll figure something out. Don't worry about it. You'll be fine. Maybe. I hope so. Let's not think about that now. We must destroy the machine. You're right. Let's do this. What even is this place exactly? This is our destination. This is where Teletubbies are created. This place gives me the chills. It's spooky as hell. Yeah, no joke. No one came down here in decades. Doesn't help that there's like zombie tubbies running around here too. Let's just destroy the thing and get the hell out of here. Well said, Miles. That's like the one thing I agree with you on. That sounds good to me. I'm down with that. What is this? Oh, can I move? What happened? Oh God, did I break the game? Oh God, is the game broken? Oh God, oh God. Oh, no. Okay, this... I don't think this is supposed to be. Oh. Oh, thank you. Oh, this is so creepy. There's newborns inside the pods. We need to destroy the machine so we can get it the hell out of here as soon as possible. Tell me I fixed it. Tell me I fixed the camera. No, I didn't fix the camera! 
No! Looking at my recording time and the fact that I am amazing at breaking games, we're gonna end the video here and pick it up in another video. I am extremely excited for this Lindy Tubbies 3 Apocalypse DLC. It looks pretty cool. Reminds me a lot of the original couple chapters of Slindy Tubbies 3, and every time something Slindy Tubbies drops, you guys want me to play it, and I am there, so stay tuned for some more awesome stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please click on the end cards at the end of this video. Also, be sure that you are subscribed to me so you can stay up to date with all the other videos that I'll be posting soon. Make someone's day, be happy, and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.